So after moving to Kumasi about four months ago, I was trying to set up a space where I can do my creative works. So far so good, this is what I've been able to do. And I posted on my community tab whether you guys wanted to see this tiny little space of mine where the creative works happen and you guys wanted to see it. So in this video, I'm going to show you this little tiny minimal workspace of mine. Let's get into the video. So the entire setup is powered by this very old Lenovo Y50 machine. This is a laptop that I got earlier this year and it has been really doing the job. It has a 16 gigs RAM, 500 SSD, a 2.5 gigahertz, and then it runs on an NVIDIA GeForce, which is good for graphics. basically i was looking for something that has a hard body that you can easily move it around because as you all know currently doing a 9 to 5 job and doing this creative work so i needed a machine that has the hard body and that can do the job and it can be taken around almost anywhere at all and this has really been doing the job it also runs on a windows 11 it has backlight key which is very nice one of the reasons why i really <laughs> bought this machine and one funny thing about this machine is that the sound is amazing sometimes when you are playing music someone might actually think that you are using an external speakers the speakers are so good and the display everything works very nice and you know it's kind of one of the phrases that say that old but still good Also, this laptop is sitting on this cooling pad or cooler pad, however you want to <laughs> say it or you want to mention it, that I got about two years back. I got this in 2021 from a store in a room somewhere. This costed around 75 cities or 80 cities. I can't really remember, but um, I lost the cable that actually cools it. But still, it has been useful because I put the laptop on it and it helps the laptop not get overheat. Okay, so. Yeah, you can try the cooler part. One thing I like about this is you can adjust the size or the length that you want it to go. It doesn't always have to be like this. You can always adjust it to any length that you want it to go. You can make it short or you can elevate it to somewhere around this area. Now, let's talk about this table. So, I got this table from China Mall. It is a normal office desk table that I got from China Mall, and I love the finish. The surface of the table is very smooth, and this was exactly what I envisioned for my, my studio, and I got it as well. So, it has a very smooth surface. It comes with a drawer that you can put a lot of things in the it has holes for cable management if you want to actually do a lot of cable management but i'm not in a position to do cable management now because literally i'm just using a laptop right now i'm trying to get a monitor and when i do i can set up my cable management and all that okay one that i was looking for is a place where i can mount my condenser microphone you know i basically record tutorial the most so i was looking for a table where i can mount the condenser microphone on it and that has a lot of space around it as well and i got exactly one and i got this for 950 gamma cities from china mall kumasi so the next item is going to be the delink router that i got in 2021 as well i got this about two years ago from edum kumase so there's a wireless router that can connect about 32 devices so as someone who uses a lot of data bundle and the internet this was a very good deal for me because i'm able to connect this to my laptop my two phones the tv over here and this bulb this yes 
this ball actually uses a wi-fi as well and of course if you have family and friends come around they are also able to connect and up to 32 devices so this is a very fair deal to me i got it about 700 cds if i remember clearly about two years ago and i've been using it and it's really been helpful as well Still over here, we have the Abungalele JBL headphone or headset and this is wireless. It has a Bluetooth, you're able to connect a micro SD to it and you can also connect a wire to it. I've been using this for about three years now, almost three years now and it's almost torn apart. But of course, if it's not actually broken at all, we are not getting one. Of course. Yeah, so if it's not totally broken, we are not getting one, okay? But on a more serious note, this has been so helpful. This is what I've been using to edit my videos. It's not noise cancelling, but it's really good. And I've been using it for almost three years now. And it's really been helpful. Still on this side, we have the condenser microphone, which basically does all the magic. Until I recently got this k wireless microphone, because I'll, I'm planning to be doing more of such videos where I have to speak into the microphone and the condenser microphone does better it is far better than this one but i can't always be carrying this along so i had to get this one so so this is what i use for my tutorials and it comes with this stand i bought it somewhere 2020 for about 250 ghana cities if i'm not wrong and that is what i've been using until the time i'm recording this video it has really really been helpful and it has recorded a lot of hate actually a lot of tutorials and yes that's it we have this light over here this table stand or desk lamp how is it even pronounced i got this from the normal light shops i got this one from techiman and it didn't come with a bulb actually the bulb was sent to me by i'm going to leave the link over here so this bulb is a wireless bulb it uses wi-fi and you're able to change the colors to so many different colors it is an led bulb it's not just one here you can change it to as many colors as possible and you need to connect it to a wi-fi and it uses an app that you can use to set it up as well i'm going to leave a link to the person that sent this bulb to me as well a big shout out to him on the back side of this we have the led strip light which you can get from almost any lighting shop or if you don't know exactly where to go just enter china mobile and you're going to get one so this is the normal led strip lights that you see in most videos and in most people's rooms and it wouldn't cost you more than say 60 70 cities you can get one now it's one of my favorite things on the desk here is the x2 wireless mouse this is a wireless chargeable mouse and i recently got it from yellow mage shop at edum kumase aseda house precisely this has really come to save me a lot of money because i was literally buying batteries here and there just like that but this is chargeable it uses a usb type c and you can charge it anytime it is down but the beautiful thing is it lasts a lot i got it i've been using it for like two months close to two months now and i've charged it for only twice so you can just imagine once the battery is low you can just plug it in and then you can charge it using your laptop you can give the wire to a head and then you can charge it as well this amase has come to save me a lot of money and i'll probably recommend that you use chargeable wireless mouse okay so after everything i needed a chair for this whole studio this whole setup and then i went in for something very simple that is adjustable so i went in for this second hand chair from a local shop here in kumasi and this cost 650 cities it is very simple you have armrest you have you can move it back so you can i don't know if you can see that so you can do something like this but it's not that very soft okay and you can also turn around here and there like that it is very simple i'm able to you know adjust it up like that and then i can as well go down 
<laughs> like that it's a very simple chair i'm um, reason i had to get it is the back right over here so you're able to you know and you can turn easily you can rest like this and you can sit with the armrest as well it also has wheels that allows you to move in so you can easily move from your desk like that to a different place if you can see this or you can actually move to this side of the so you can easily move within the room just move to the camera to pick something and then you can move out as well seamlessly okay can even use this for a transition what do you think so i come like that and then i will move back nicely what do you think this is going to be on tiktok probably the chair is good for 650 cities this is okay for me you can get one of the second hand chairs like this if you're on a very low budget or if you're on budget and you want to create something simple like my space Now after the deck setup, I needed to spice this place up with something nice and I got inspired from Pinterest to put up this metal um, work that you're seeing here. So I literally hired a welder, to, a local welder to weld this for me and a carpenter to put in the, um, the woodworks as well. So, and I got these flowers from China Mall to you know give it that whole studio vibe and this entire setup will cost you roughly around 350 to 400 Ghana cities depending on where you're doing it from and depending on your relationship with the people that you're going to hire to do this and then i actually brought this frame also from you know my my previous setup so these frames were already in the previous setup and then this light i recently made a video about it i got this from gg a random person from gg and it will cost you 150 cities each the wall shelf right over there that one too i got it from a local carpenter i think these are basic things that you can get from anywhere at all that you are so basically that is the entire studio very simple i decided to go with something very minimal very simple and as you can see from the background like i told you from the beginning the studio is a very tiny space and i really struggled to make this video because i had to like put the camera to different angles so that i can get different shots while trying to make sure that no part that i don't want you to see actually comes in but it actually worked out what do you think about this whole setup what do you think about this studio i'm trying to get a monitor very soon and add it up so that the setup will kind of you know complete and you know you can sponsor this channel by watching the videos not skipping the ads and once you get a monitor on here the studio is going to really level up and be kind of complete but let me know your thoughts about this studio my very my very basic minimal studio my very basic minimal my very basic tiny minimal studio let me know your thoughts in the comment section and i hope this will inspire you to you know take your graphics most of these things were bought from my graphic design works by taking your graphic design serious and taking your practice serious you most likely would be able to set up something like this for yourself this is not the best but at my level this is okay for me and i'm proud that i've been able to put up something like this I hope this inspires you to you know work hard to take your your design serious and to put up something like this for yourself yeah i've talked too much i probably would have to go back and record a tutorial for you thank you so much for sticking around to watch this video don't forget to like and subscribe and let me check if this is really working or recording i'll see you guys in the next video it's innocent here and bye